Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I know it has been um, a while since I have done a grocery haul. So today I am going to do, I guess it will be called like the end of the month, unexpected grocery haul. Um, this is not my normal once a month grocery shopping. This is just something I've done because my kids are going back to school full time and not just on a hybrid schedule. So I know I'll need like snacks for after school, lunches for school, um, for everybody. So that is what this grocery haul is. I went to Smith's here in Farmington, Nature's, what the heck is it called? Nature something. I gotta figure out the name. I'll tell you in a minute. Um, it's, oh, natural, natural grocers. Um, with like organic food and a healthier choice of food because we, I can't say like we're going gluten-free or organic. I think I told you in my last haul, I'm not that type of person, but we are trying to get healthier by healthier snacks. Um, we have all, I think, put on weight during this quarantine time. So it is time, uh-oh, I knocked some down. It's time to try to cut off some of this weight um, and we know a way to do that is to eat a little bit healthier. So we tried healthier snacks, healthier things. We're gonna see how it goes. Can't make any promises, but we'll see how it goes. And of course I had to go to Sam's um, because they sell in bulk. And when you have a family of eight, you have to buy in bulk. Um, I will say, just in case this is your first time here, my name is Tani. I am a stay-at-home mom of eight. Um, one of my daughters have left the nest. So right now, uh, it's a stay-at-home mom of seven, but she has gotten her own apartment. So I am proud and of course, happy for that. Um, I have a 21-year-old daughter that I always say is awesomely autistic. So you will hear her toys and her in the background because I'm gonna be doing a talk through. So you'll hear her because she is in here. Um, but yeah, let's get started. Okay, so this is from Natural Grocers. I keep saying nature's best, that's a brand. But anyway, these are some um, organic uh, candy chews. So I thought about like an alternative for just candy with all the sugar. Um, this is not one of my healthy choices. These are the Brownie Bites from Sam's. Uh, we all love those. Then I have, because the kids are loving um, maple and brown sugar oatmeal in the morning. This one, um, it's gluten-free, but I got gluten-free because that's what they had. I was really going for organic. But whatever the case, it's the instant oatmeal uh, with the brown sugar maple. Um, then I got the organic taco shells. And everything that's organic pretty much was from natural grocers. If not, I'll tell you. Um, then the pistachios, those are from uh, Sam's Club. I got these huge, let me see how I can do this. I got these um, pretzels because Did they're the a mark. You oh, the camera. Oh. oh my God. Okay, so that's my son just stepping in the camera um, asking, did I get cheese for press? But anyway, um, these, no, these are the super soft pretzels. These are super good. And it comes with salt in the box and cinnamon. And then um, these are from Sam's, the sweet and salty. Cody loves these. Um, and I think Genesis likes those too. I already showed you these. And then I found an alternative for just cookies. So these came actually from Smith's, but they are party cake cookies. They're organic. And then these came from Smith's, the chocolate chip uh, cookies. And then, okay. These are the snack, uh, like trail mixes. 
And then, and you know what? This Annie's, I got a lot of stuff this brand so from um, this one? Natural Grocers, and it's supposed to be really good. And then I got these, their snack. I thought they were good alternative for the, I think they're called like cheeses. I got these walnut um, halves, and these were on sale at Smith's. I'm making something with this. It's like a cake. And I actually got some caramel, some chocolate, and instant coffee for that recipe as well. And then this is some more um, like cheddar bunnies. Okay. Um, and then, move, move. Um, oh, because they love fruit roll-ups. Like we went through 72 fruit roll-ups in two days. That was outrageous and uncalled for. So I got these uh, swirly fruit tape things and strawberry for that. Of course, these are not healthy. I love them, Pharaoh loves them, but they're the Lucky Charm treat cereal bars. They're super good. Uh, the Nest Quick. Uh, we run through this. Everybody loves chocolate milk. Um, and then I got some cakes just because I make them cakes and stuff after school. Some lemon cakes. These are awesome snack. The kids love these bagel bites, the pizza snacks. And then I'm gonna try and transition to like um, pizzas and stuff that would be good. So these some organic wood fried, uh, wood fired pizza from Natural Grocers. And let's see, let me move and promise turn the camera with me so they can see me over here. The stuff I'm doing. Can you see? Yes. Okay. And then uh, my husband. One of this bratwurst. He has a new smoker, so he has been smoking at the storm, which I'm happy. It helps me. It gives me a break. It's and it's really good food. He, he knows what he's doing. We got this huge um this beef brisket on sale for thirty four dollars. That was an awesome price for this. So it's really big. Then we found chips. So everybody loves hot chips. So we found these chips at Natural Grocers. Um, real pepper, real heat. Um, and then the salt and vinegar chips. We love this brand and salt and vinegar. So those found these hickory barbecue kettle chips. And then these were surprisingly good. Um, these are real vegetable chips. And this is the garlic and herbs. Um, so this one is good, it's like sweet potatoes, all kinds of stuff. These are really good. And we opened these up in the car and started eating them. Um, then plantain sea salt uh, chips. These were good too. And this came from natural Ranch. Um, And then I got, go that way pretty girl, go that way. Okay, I got the um, Choice Beef Lawn Carne Asada uh, Flap Steak Chips. Like, I'm gonna make some tacos with this. Got this from Smith. Um, and That's then it. I got, oh, these are the um, salads. My daughter Genesis has asked me for salads for lunch. So I found these at Smith's, some organic salads. Um, then I got the plant-based nuggets for Marcelina because she loves nuggets, but I want to see about her, just like us, losing a couple of pounds, so I got her those. Um, Devon loves these, the mousse cake, chocolate mousse things. Um, that's like a pudding, yeah. So he loves those. Pause it, pause it. Okay, so before I had to stop the recording, um, these are the mousse uh, chocolate things. And like we were saying, it's almost like a, a 
Well, you would know what moose is, but Devon loves these things. I don't eat them. Um, so then, and Selena came back out. I stopped filming because she's having kind of a bad day right now. So um, I'm trying to help, but it's hard. She wants to be out here while I'm recording. So this is life, but yes. Um, so we found this at Natural Grocers. This is some black cherry, um, like jelly jam stuff. And then this is for my recipe, the caramel flavored topping and the instant coffee is as well. I was able to find some organic instant coffee. And then um, Devon wanted to try the peanut butter, uh, the organic peanut butter, but I think it's gonna taste the same. I think it's just like a healthier choice. And then I got these Annie's um, mac and cheese snacks for the kids for after school. And because I always bake them cookies or cake and stuff, I found these um, cookies to bake and they're organic chocolate chip. Um, and I don't know if I showed you the plant-based nuggets, but these are it. And I got these from Sam's, which I was shocked. But I got them from Sam's. This is also for my uh, cake recipe. It's the chocolate candy coating. I gotta melt that down. I was able to find some organic ice cream because everybody loves that. Um, well, they love ice cream. I don't know if it's gonna taste any different. And then the popsicles. I've tried these before, the, um, the fruit bars. They love these, so I'm happy about that, that these are good. They're the Simply, or Simply Truth Organic brand from Smith's. Um, and then I got these from Sam's, and I had to get two of these because we run through them. Um, and then almonds milk. Marcelina loves almonds milk. I got this heavy whipping cream, but I have to get more. I meant to buy more, and I only bought this one. Um, and then I'm gonna move over. Let me get the camera. Okay, so this is uh, bananas and then the applesauce. Let's see. The, the applesauce. Um, these are great for lunches because you just drop them in there. This is something Devon wanted to try. The yogurt, some yogurt. And he got like three, a lemon, a strawberry, and a black cherry, some pineapples, some uh, grapes. I don't know what this, what did he say? Garlic, this is gar, is it garlic or something else? It's, I forgot what he said it was. But it's something he got, he's doing some kind of um, challenge, this lose weight challenge and he uses that. Go ask your daddy what this is. Ask him what that is and then come back and tell me. Because I wouldn't tell him what it is. Okay, cucumbers. If you watch my channel at any point, you know Canelo Ferro loves cucumbers and ranch. So I have a bunch of uh, organic cucumbers. I got some, uh, this is the cabbage, the red cabbage. Um, I'm trying to make it all stay up here. Then let me move over. Okay, and juice. I got a bunch of juice because we run through juice. So I got a whole lot of juice and we, we for a while now, I would say about two, well no, maybe about a month, we've been drinking only organic juice. So this is their favorite. The white grape is their favorite. They love this one. And then for school, I got these for them to take for juice. I don't know. We're I think I've showed you. Too busy playing basketball. Oh, okay. Well, they're playing basketball, so he won't tell us what it is. But I'm pretty sure I'm right that it's garlic, fresh garlic. Okay. And then um, this is more juice, and this is their favorite to take school. 
the Berry Good Lemonade, if you want to start going with an organic juice, the Onyx Kids uh, Berry Good Lemonade, they say it has more flavor than the other ones. All the kids told me that. Well, not all of them, but some of the kids told me that, and then my husband told me that this one was the best. Do you think this one is good, Gigi? What? The... Very no, good lemonade. lemonade. Don't have no that, no, that very good one. The fruit punch one. That's the one. Oh, well, and I the got purple the one. Oh, the purple one. Yeah, and good. that so one. So the grape is good. So I had it confused. The grape one is good. And then they're saying the fruit punch one is good. So those are really good. Uh, the kids like them. And then the orange juice, of course. And just some lemonade for the house. I won't show you all of these, but some lot of juices. Um, and then back to the unhealthy stuff here. Um, I love these in the morning. So these are plain cake donuts. Nobody likes them but me, I don't think. But I love the cake donuts. And then I got them the glazed donuts um, that they can eat. And then we will move over to stuff that's not grocery. Let's see, I have to move the camera with me here to the other side. <laughs> okay. So, okay, this is, am I, I have to make sure sometimes I'm recording. Okay, I needed to get, Downy Fabric Softener. Got this from everything here that I'm showing you now is from Sam's. But I got Fabric Softener. I think I already said I never go to the store now and not pick up wipes because it's uh, hard to come by them. It's getting a little better. I got the Cascade Platinum um, Dishwasher Soap. I will tell you why. So I was using um, Myers. And I'll try to put the camera on me. But I was using Myers. And the Myers um, and the seventh generation had my dishes looking just, oh my gosh, like blotchy. They would be clean, but they were so ashy looking and just dusty looking, like a lot of debris that I, I would not suggest to anybody. I was willing to pay the money for it to be non-harsh, but no, I, I will not do that. When I was using Cascade, I, it was like streak-free, no issues. So I would suggest the Cascade. I, the Myers, I just had a horrible experience. I'm, and I'm, if I'm gonna pay $10 for 20 pods, they shouldn't have any problems. I was having problems. So yeah, going with that. Um, and then, okay, back to the groceries, the power wash. This is another one that is kind of a hit and miss for me. When I got the apple scent of this, it was horrible. It, we could not see what all the raven was about because everybody's like, oh, Don power wash this, Don. And I just could not see what they love so much because to me, it didn't work that well. I went and got, so we tried a different scent, which is the craziest thing. This one is the fresh scent. Works great. We see what they were raving about. You spray this on there. Yes, it will water just wipes away. No scrubbing, very true. You get the apple one, I do not agree. But the fresh scent, yes, it works. I got this uh, Lysol laundry sanitizer because as you know, we had another COVID scare. So I wanna be able to wash down everything with that. Um, and then I got the Unstoppables, of course. I always get these from Sam's. And they had the three pack of the Lysol spray back. So of course I got that. And then these are the fabric sheets I use, the Bounce Outdoor. And I do plan on trying the uh, dryer balls that everybody talks about with the scent oil in them. I am gonna try that, I just haven't yet. And then sinuses are at all time high in my house, so I bought a bulk load of tissue. <laughs> 
so that is my mini haul um and let me get the camera on okay, me. so i had to put the camera back on me so now i done lost my train of thought that i said put the camera back on me i can't remember what i was gonna say but whatever the case oh i know if you like to see grocery hauls this way let me know I'll do more, more grocery hauls this way. If you prefer me do it where it was a talk through um, and I wasn't babbling on so much, I will do that. Good, my husband came in. Look, no, go get that. What is that? What is that you bought? Okay, he's putting the hat on first, gosh. Anyway, and if you like content like this, then please subscribe. Yeah. Um, oh my God. Tell them, what is that? What is that you bought? What is it? That thing. What's what? The, that. This? That. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What? I was trying to say what it was. All right, guys. Oh my. <laughs> this is the sticky of the icky. Oh, the icky. Is he in the camera? Yes. Okay. Ginger root. Ginger, oh. I said, what did I say it was? You said it was the sticky of the icky. I say it's garlic or something. Yeah, no, this is ginger root, man. Ginger I'm using root. it for uh, uh, dietary purposes. I'm trying to uh, cut down. I think he's sexy the way he is, but he want to lose weight. I, I told him he should keep his weight. I think weight looks good on him, but whatever. He wants to lose weight. So anyway, um, I'm going to insert some other things in this video, but if you only came for the grocery haul, then thank you for watching. Um, this is my crazy uh, house. And it's, of course, you're going to hear noise and everything in the background. But I will stop rambling on and show you some of the other things. I am doing um, the recipe in here today for what I'm cooking. So you will get to see this chicken, that the chicken tender, uh, buffalo chicken tender strips that I cook. Uh, everybody in the family loves them. I can't say this is a healthy choice because it's not, um, because they are being deep fried. So, but no, but it's really good. So if you don't mind the calories and frying, then it tastes really good. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna keep, quit babbling on and insert some stuff, but thank you for coming. Thank you for watching and tell somebody else about my channel and yeah, see you guys in a bit. Okay guys, so for this recipe, I use chicken tenders, salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, cayenne pepper. Um, I think in this recipe, I actually forgot to use my cayenne pepper, but I typically do use that as well. Um, and I also use the Walmart brand of the wing sauce, the spicy wing sauce. Um, and just a little side note, that the sauce works good for so many things if you fry wings and then you want to have like a sauce to just throw on them it's awesome this sauce tastes awesome but i put um the chicken tenders in a bag put all my seasonings in there and then i pour in the wing sauce i get it spread around all good and i typically soak it uh not soak it but i typically marinate it overnight but on this particular day, I only marinated for about four or five hours um, and it still came out just as good. Um, and then I also use the uh, granola oil to fry it in. If you prefer like vegetable oil or peanut oil, whatever oil you like to use, you can use it. I just use granola oil um, to fry things in. But yeah, it's just that simple. And you'll see as the video goes on that I'll, uh, after the marinade comes out, I'll dip it into a flour bag, get it uh, all battered up with the flour and then fry it. It cooks really fast, which is good if you're looking for just like a quick dinner or even a snack or lunch um, for the night or the middle of the day, whichever is your preference.
So guys, you will see on the side, kind of in the background, I did use pasta roni to go with this and it's the garlic um, and something flavor, but it's it, they have a lot of flavors of it. Um, it's something that's really good, really quick. Um, and I'll tell you again, this is something else that I use and I do so many quick things with the pasta roni. I've cut up um, like Italian sausages in there, kielbasa sausage added it to it. I've um, added like peppers with it. There are so many um, good recipes you can do with this as a base if you're looking for something really quick and you don't want to go and like make mashed potatoes from scratch or something like that. And this particular night, because I had done grocery shopping and so many things, I just was not feeling like cooking at all, but I wanted to um, do this because I promised everybody that we have it for the night. Well, not everybody, but my husband. And so he was really looking forward to it and he would have been so upset if I hadn't done it. Um, so I just went on and did it anyway. So I just needed a quick side and this, uh, the pasta roni works out great for a quick side. Or if you wanna use it, um to do something else like i said you can let me know down in the comment section if you like to see more recipes that i can do with this pasta roni and i can show you um some more recipes that's like really good that would include shrimp or um just some other things Okay, so with this pasta roni recipe, um, well, the box recipe, with that, it calls for like a stick of butter when you're using two boxes like I am, but I didn't want to use a whole bunch of butter, so I used um, olive oil kind of as a substitute. Um, so I only put less than a half a stick of butter in there and then some olive oil for the rest of it. And I want to tell you guys, if you like the content that you are seeing today, then definitely give this video a thumbs up. It helps me out. Um, and then I would love it if you would consider subscribing. Uh, when you are going along about your day, you know you need something to do, something to watch. Um, you can just... Uh, subscribe to my channel and then you can watch me clean with me cook with me and hopefully get you motivated throughout your week don't forget when you subscribe to turn on that notification bell so that you can be notified of all my future uploads and know when I am creating a new video or when it's already been created rather and yes tell somebody else about my channel and have them come along leave me a comment down below let me know who you are and that you are watching or other things that you would like to see
So guys, this is the finished product. I hope you enjoy. Hope to see you next time. Bye.